My name is Andrew Almonte. This is my husband, Angel Almonte. And this is our um, new son. He, his name is Aaron Almonte. And he is um, three months and three weeks. We did a lot of research. It took us about two years before we actually found out about men having babies. The GPAP program was obviously the most important part of it because actually that's what we actually needed. But um, the process itself was very nerve-wracking, if I could say, um, because it's an acceptance thing, qualifying, and you know, put, you're given so much of your information and so much details. And to qualify for stage one is one thing, but to qualify for stage two uh, is the goal, and it was very, very um, traumatic in a way. When we got denied the first time, it was excruciating for me and for us as well. And, you know, I told Andrew, you know what, Andrew? Let's set up the baby's room. Let's bring him in because he ha we have to bring the energy in. Because sometimes it's not just about trusting the process, it's about what you're trying to pull in from your energy. And, like I said, the we, law of attraction. We, we set up the baby's room two weeks later. I don't know if that was what made it happen, but <laughs> here we are today. We actually got matched with um, Connecticut Fertility uh, with Dr. L, and then we got matched with uh, Circle Surrogacy. And the beginning to the end was so smooth. I mean, they were great. We, um, through the clinic in Connecticut, they helped us find an egg donor. Uh, from that moment on, once we did all the research, which took a couple of weeks, we then decided to find a donor and we went in, we interviewed her. Uh, she was willing to meet with us. Uh, she was a perfect match. And then a um, couple of weeks, months later, we started looking for a surrogate. I think the beginning might be the biggest challenge. Why? Because you're so in depth of trying to find the perfect donor, the perfect surrogate. And in reality, we didn't, at one point, we pretty much stopped looking for the face. We went more for quality and the, what we thought aligned with what we were looking for. It's just so much information and it can be very overwhelming walking into something you have no knowledge about whatsoever. And coming to these conferences, there are a huge amount of information, but also a lot of resources that really just help you navigate your way through the entire process and really simplify it. Our process was seamless. We did have our reserves. We thought that we were gonna have so many challenges along the way and um, we actually just did it. And it really just worked out fantastic. My advice would really be just take your time. Um, don't, don't become overwhelmed. Take your notes, show up at every meeting, be prompt, um, ask questions, don't be timid, and um, take your tenacity um, with pen to paper and really just, um, just navigate and chart your way through it. And I think men having babies is just overall just fantastic. Um, they will help simplify the process. And even if you don't get accepted, they have so many other takeaways that you can benefit from.